I'll tell you what, you know, I stayed up late last night. I was finishing my PowerPoints mm. for, for the conference. Yeah. And, um, and, uh, and I woke up and I'm like, what is the best decision for me right now? I know I need some caffeine. And mm. I was like, I can't do anything except purity because yeah. I know that by the time 3 p.m. hits, which is now, um, I would be pretty much on my, on my butt. Yeah. <laughs> And so um, with what purity and what I always experience is that it's, it's like a pick me up and it's, it's kind of like, it's kinda like an adaptogen. It helps my body adapt to the situations, which is, which is fascinating. And number one, number two, um, the coffee that I drank this morning, I'm still tasting it in my mouth. Okay? okay. And that's true for a lot of different foods that activate neurotransmitters to make you feel good. The NMDA neuro, uh, and receptors. Yeah and uh, even the opioid receptors. And so as I'm talking to you, we're talking about purity coffee, I can actually taste it, uh, which, is, which is a really good thing. And if you think about it, that is your brain recalling back something that is uh, very advantageous for you. It's also your body trying to tell you that that might have been a good thing that, that entered the body. So, and that's, that's, a, that's a physiologic state that people can be in. And it's really trying to remember things that, that, that are going back in time that's, that's really good for you. And so I believe in a higher power. So whatever higher power is telling me to, to taste this right now, I'm tasting it as you're talking right. about, I'm tasting it as you're talking about how, how these, these beans are grown, the harvesting, and I'm imagining in my head and it gives me that sort of a, a, a nice uh, feedback into what this is. And so um, it, it makes me also very sad uh, that most coffees in America are not perceived this way. Yeah. Um, it also makes me very sad that when we look at coffee, um, there is such a huge negative connotation to it. But we know, we know based on a lot of different studies that co the coffee's benefits are, are there, right? Even if it's not purity brand, because purity didn't exist when Absolutely. those studies were done, right? Agreed. So we know that helps with memory, in increasing uh, the, the, the drivers of, of developing memory in the brain, the cyclic GMP and all these different processes. And we know that not only does it help with memory, it actually can possibly uh, uh, decrease the decline of brain streaking in different parts of the brain as well. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, in, in what we do, what well, we want to grow back brain, we, that's, that's our thing, you yeah. know? And so um, in the process of talking about something like anti-aging, uh, and the process of talking about so getting your antioxidants in, I think this goes uh, in line with that.